What's good y'all, it's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So we're gonna check out top 10 craziest fan reactions to a wrestler's return. Now, I happened to wake up this morning, I checked my YouTube and I'm actually subscribed to Wrestling of Flashback. So you guys should be subscribed to him as well. He makes some great wrestling related content. And I see in my sub box that I'm like, I see myself on the thumbnail of fans completely stunned. And I was like, oh, I gotta check this out. I, as soon as I saw myself on the thumbnail, I had to check it out. The fact that I'm in a wrestling flashback video, man, you, I, I just like, I don't even know what to say. You know what I'm saying? These past few weeks have been incredible, especially when it comes to, you know, the wrestling content. Me and Dub, we've been seen on TV for the past two weeks on Monday Night Raw and SmackDown. We had a dope interview with Mark Henry and Bubba Ray Dudley. CM Punk reposted our reaction to him returning to WWE. And now I'm in a wrestling flashback video. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is awesome. And shout out to everyone. I was just, I, I didn't even watch the video. I just scrolled to the comments. And shout out to people that was showing me love in the comment section down below, man. I really do appreciate everyone that supported me and dub you know all this year and just in the years past uh to get the channels uh you know that we have now where they are now shout out to wrestling flashback for even featuring me in this video it is such an honor <laughs> to be featured in this video i had to check this out today y'all i had some other videos lined up today but i had to check this one out appreciate all love and support man i'm excited to check out just to see myself in this and to see some of these other dope content creators as well let's get right into this one i'm excited man oh this is awesome <laughs> no form of entertainment does unexpected returns like wrestling oh wow you just never know for sure until they come <laughs> through the curtain oh my god oh my god shout out to mini uh she follows me on instagram we follow each other on instagram shout out to her man she has some dope content wrestling related content as well so shout out to her uh for being featured uh on smackdown and raw as well man <laughs> oh, yo! Yo! What? <laughs> it's excitement action entertainment and surprise all wrapped into one oh, oh, <laughs> they brought it back Oh man, <laughs> I remember this. <laughs> oh, they brought it back with this one. Damn. <laughs> what happened? Oh no! Oh, What's happening? No. What's happening? Oh no! But these returns are nothing without the response of the fans. Facts. What the fuck? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Today, we're highlighting some of the best fan reactions to wrestlers returning to WWE. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> bruh, bruh. As we list the top 10 craziest this returns that made fans go nuts. Ah. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! First, let's give out a few honorable mentions, such as Shane McMahon's return in 2016, yeah. which absolutely no one saw coming. Did not see this one coming. Here comes the money. Yeah. That was crazy. I was not expecting Shane to come back. <laughs> that was a holy shit moment for sure. The Undertakers had so many great returns, they could take up their own list. <laughs> yup, American Badass. Oh my God. Feel the disdain. This was a cool moment right here. This is such a cool moment. And we can't forget Triple H's return in 2002. Mm -hmm. Just imagine the reaction videos if social media was around back then. Facts. Now on to the list. Number 10, Stone Cold 2018. Even though Austin's in-ring career ended in 2003, there's still nothing quite like hearing that glass break whenever mm -hmm. Stone Cold drops back Always. In. Yep. Every time, gets the blood pumping. Oh, man. He had many returns in the late 90s and early 2000s that made the fans in the arena go nuts. 
<laughs> Look at that. Yup. Good thing Blackman's not in the car. Right Whoop! <laughs> Steve made a career of whipping the McMahon's ass, so it was pure nostalgia to see the rattlesnake running it back at Raw 25 in 2018. There's not mm -hmm. one person in the world that's ever helped me. Yep. <laughs> There's no way you could celebrate the anniversary of Monday Night Raw without the man that made the show famous. Of course. Fans quite rightly lost their mind when Austin entered. There's not one person in the world that's ever helped me. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome, bro. <laughs> That's awesome. I bet just hearing that's like uh something on my bucket list to be able to hear the glass break or if you smell, you know, being being there live, I can only imagine the goosebumps, the excitement. That I would love to be able to experience that live, you know, in my lifetime, bro. Jeez, man. Shout out to everyone that was able to experience those type of moments live, man. <laughs> Not one person in the world that's ever helped me. Oh my! <laughs> <laughs> bro it's, it's that universal love that's why that's why we get excited some people make the comment like why y'all getting excited why y'all losing yourselves over you know wrestlers it's fake and all this other stuff and it's like one of those things where it's like it's something that wrestling fans love and appreciate especially when their favorites come back and make a return a surprise return we grew up watching these individuals so to hear their music hit it brings all those great memories of you watching them back in the day it comes right back in one moment that's why we get excited the same way people get excited for football teams and, and basketball teams when they win close games and win championships it's the same thing here man it's just it's it's hard to explain. You have to really love wrestling to understand that excitement you get when you ex don't expect someone to return. My talent. See? I just said it. <laughs> Stone Cold Steve Austin. <laughs> <laughs> Number 9, Rey Mysterio 2018. Always a crowd favorite, it was sad to see Rey Mysterio get booed out of the building at the 2014 yeah. Royal Rumble. It of was course. one of his last appearances in his first run with the company. Tonight. Yeah, it was just unfortunate timing, bro. It wasn't his fault. The response to Rey's return at the same event four years later was the complete yeah. opposite. He got a much better reaction. Fans went crazy as Mysterio mm -hmm. returned looking like he did in his early 20s and moving just as quick. Yep. That was a good moment for Ray. Man. Look at that reaction. I love how everyone reacted at the same time. They hear his music hit and they're like, wait, what? Oh, shit, it's Ray. I love that. <laughs> no way! No fucking way! No way! Oh, wow. <laughs> Redeem yourself. Good. What the? That's so cool. Oh no. Bro, his face lit up. Please <laughs> do 
He got the mask. <laughs> he <didn't steal> you. <laughs> <laughs> this Yo, is so great. Bro! Ray Mysterio! Oh my god! Bro! 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 Oh! Number 8, Chris Jericho, 2007. Mm. Y2J is the king of reinvention. He was yep. famous for dropping in and out of WWE, returning every time with an impact. Yep. Yep. But Jericho first returned in 2007, yeah. sporting a brand new look. But in the months leading up to his return, numerous vignettes aired, encouraging people to crack. This was actually cool. This was so good. I remember I watched it when he returned. I was like, oh, Jericho is back. This should be good. The code to determine who was coming back. It didn't take fans long to figure out the code was referring to Y2J, but this only added suspense for his impending return, mm -hmm. as the people in attendance at the November 19th Raw in Fort Lauderdale completely lost it when Chris yep. finally appeared. That's so cool, bro. So cool. They built up his return so great. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my god, radio. It's Y2J. 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 <laughs> my man's impersonating uh, JR doing a pretty good job with the hat, too. It's Y2J. Y2J. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Look at the footage. Number seven, Quality. Brock Lesnar, 2012. Ooh. Lesnar's part-time schedule over the years has meant we've seen him return plenty of times. Oh my! I can beat up Brock Lesnar. <laughs> <laughs> we all know Dub would not like this part, for sure. <laughs> oh man. But this slew of returns all began when Brock first came back in 2012. Yep. After applying his trade in the UFC, Lesnar returned to WWE a bigger star than he was before. And the fans couldn't wait to see the Beast mix uh -huh. it up with the current crop of talent, which included John Cena, who Lesnar had previously destroyed during Cena's Jesus. early days. But now John was on Brock's level and eager to welcome Lesnar back to WWE. But what? Brock had other ideas, all while the Raw after WrestleMania crowd continued to make mm -hmm. noise. <laughs> Crowd went crazy. Crowd went crazy live. <laughs> fuck yes! Yes! Get the fuck yes! <laughs> oh. Fuck yes! <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Yeah, this Holy was a crazy shit. moment. Brock return fans didn't see coming came at Summer Sam 2021 uh -huh. following the main event. The element of surprise led to some shock but celebratory fan reactions. Just like it. Yep. <laughs> That's when I knew old business has picked up because we have a different Roman Reigns now against a Brock Lesnar. Business had picked up. This video is a, it's an instant like, bro. There should be, <laughs> y'all gotta like this video. This is fucking fantastic. 
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Roman Reigns has retained his title, and freaking Brock Lesnar is here! Oh! Oh, oh shit! What happened? Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Your arch nemesis! Oh, my God! Oh, no! Oh, no! What is he doing now? Oh, my God. That was so great. Y'all know Dub don't like Brock. So after, you know, we expected Roman Reigns to win. You know what I'm saying? That's that's kind of what we expected. When we heard Brock's music, I knew what was coming. I knew. Dub was going to be like, what the fuck? Oh, man. John Cena, 2021. This one Cena right loves here. a good return. His appearance always this one right here was no wild. The occasion, but especially when we haven't seen him in a while. For example, at the 2008 yep. Royal Rumble, when nobody expected him to come back from injury. This was crazy, so too. <laughs> no one expected that, though. Bro. We're now going to look at John's return Crazy. from Money in the Bank 2021. Mm -hmm. It was the first time Cena appeared in front of fans in a year and a half. Mm -hmm. And it's clear not everyone was expecting to see him. But even the ones that were went absolutely bananas. <laughs> <laughs> look at that reaction, bro. Look at that, bro. Bro, that's bro. I lost my shit. <laughs> I couldn't help it. I was not expecting that. Oh. <laughs> we acknowledge you. <laughs> <laughs> he went from we acknowledge you to. <laughs> no. Oh, uh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Bro, well, right here. Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! There we go. There we go. I've, I've, the time has just flown. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That was such a cool moment. No one saw that coming, and oh man! Holy fucking shit! Holy fucking shit! <laughs> but his face. Get the fuck out of here! Get This is it's so good, bro. This, Holy cow! this is awesome, man. It's <laughs> this is it's so happening, good. <laughs> it's happening. And Cena would do the same two years later at the same event in London, England. Uh huh. No! Yep. No! Wow, man. <laughs> Look at that, man. Oh, that's so awesome. 
number five, Hardy Boys 2017. This was Return really good. Different since it takes place on the grandest stage of them all. At Mania, the fans are already hyped as can be. So imagine how they might react to such a heart stopping return like the Hardys yep. at WrestleMania 33. The Hardys returned at That was the best that moment of that WrestleMania. Wrestle I'm not even going to lie to you. That was, a, that was the highlight of the show for me. The Hardys returning back, that was the highlight of the show for me, bro. In a match type, they help make famous. What? Oh my! Things are about to be broken! The this reaction is so the great, bro. around the world was palpable. This People is so great. People were overjoyed great. to see Matt and Jeff back home in WWE after nearly a decade away. Yeah. <laughs> that was so cool, bro. And that stage was so dope, too. Yeah. Is it going to be the new day? Shout out to Grim, man. <laughs> Shout out to Grim, one of the OGs in the wrestling community, man. Look at all those people. This just shows how popular the Hardy Boys are and have always been. I just wish they were utilized a little bit better in AEW, but they're goats. <laughs> what are we talking about? Goats. <laughs> this is so dope, bro. The dogs was just chilling there. Oh, what's going on? <laughs> I was like, damn. Yes. Yes. Fuck yes. What the fuck? Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Every. Oh. <laughs> Your excitement. I love it. Number four, Cody Rose, 2022. This is a good AEW's one, too. Rival promotion is a big deal, especially yep. when a wrestler is immediately started into a top position. But it's even bigger to be the first one to make the move and to do it on the biggest show of the year. Yep. This was how Cody Rose returned to WWE at WrestleMania 38, sending the wrestling world and the fans into Facts. a frenzy. <laughs> this is so cool, bro. <laughs> oh my god, this is so good. That's dope. It was an earth. That's dope. Shout out to uh I believe that's Brandon. Yeah, that's shout out to him, another dope creator. Another dope uh uh wrestling creator, man. It was an earth-shaking acquisition and a return only fitting for the show of shows. The fans completely ate it up, mm -hmm. having witnessed a truly historic moment. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good, man. It's Cody! It's Cody! Yeah, man, yeah! We all kind of knew, but it's just to see it happening. We're so great. Yes! 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 They did it! Yes! Hold on, they hold on, did it! Hold on, hold on, it's I'm behind, I'm behind. I'm... Oh my god! He's got oh he's got the, the nightmare family logo too! Oh my god! Oh. Wow. Cody. wow, they were in the skybox. Wow. That's tough. Yep. Wait. Wait. <laughs> oh! Let's go. That was so cool, bro. I we had the speculation. We we kind of knew, but just to see it happening. 
They kept the theme song, everything, the pyro, how it looked. It just, it was perfect. Fantastic. Cody! Oh. Cody! Oh. I'm trying to make me cry on this. <laughs> Number three, The Rock. 2011. Mm -hmm. It was always a treat to see The Rock return after he stepped away from the WWE to do movies. He came down running. The Rock is cooking. Look at that reaction, man. But none of The Rock's returns hit as strong as his 2011 mm -hmm. comeback. After Vince McMahon revealed WrestleMania 27 would have a guest host, fans speculated who it could be until mm -hmm. finally The Great One's iconic music hit and the millions came on. Yep. <laughs> Look at that reaction, man. This run ultimately led to a return to the ring and a world title mm -hmm. run. But we'll always remember that first night in Anaheim when The Rock gave the WWE a boost of electricity it hadn't felt in quite some time. Bro, listen to that. Listen to that. I'm getting goosebumps. <laughs> He couldn't even say any words. <laughs> Number two, Edge 2020. Mm. After retiring from wrestling in 2011 due to a history of neck issues, no one expected Edge to ever step back in the square circle due to the severity of his injuries. Edge had previously returned from an injury at the 2010 Royal Rumble, much mm -hmm. to the delight of the crowd in attendance. Yep. But after getting physical at the 2019 SummerSlam, fans were hopeful of seeing the rated R superstar wrestle again. These hopes came to fruition yep. at the 2020 Royal Rumble, where fans marked out like crazy to see the 11 time world champion return to the ring. Oh. He's Look at that. Bro. Oh, my. He's oh my God, man. You think you know me? Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> you think you know me? Just look at just, uh, I'm getting goosebumps all over again, bro. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> it's Edge. He <laughs> hit the. Oh. <laughs> I love it, man. Oh my, oh, my <laughs> oh my god! 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 She's having a panic oh god. attack down there. Oh my god! <laughs> no way! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! That's great. That's fantastic. That's that's perfect. That's perfect right there. <laughs> oh hey God. man, hold on, bro. Hey man, whoa, 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 whoa. My man I'm about to take off the pants too. Whoa, you ain't gotta do all that now. <laughs> Number one, CM Punk 2023. Oh, Few people boy. have the ability to affect wrestling like CM Punk. Oh, it seems boy. like every time he returns, he turns the industry on its head. 
Oh boy. Punk Song awaited in ring return to WWE in 2023 seemed like it would never happen. But you never say never in wrestling. You never Time say heals never. wounds, and if it's best for business, they'll always come back. And no group of people benefits from this more than the fans. For a yep. moment as massive as Punk's return, we remember where we were and how we reacted. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Shout out to Christian. I'm subscribed to him as well. <laughs> His reaction was hilarious. His, his face just completely changed. <laughs> <laughs> predictions that CM Punk is going to be at oh my god oh my god what the fuck oh my fucking god I don't think this is over man oh yo yo what oh my god he's actually here yo what the hell oh god, <laughs> he had to get out the body me. suit get the shit off me what the Shout it's out to CM Punk. Oh, there it is. What the fuck? <laughs> there it is. Oh my god. I take everything back that I just said. I take it all back. <laughs> this show needed CM Punk. <laughs> uh oh. Shout out to Weezy Blonde. Are you fucking uh, serious? Uh, blonde. <laughs> She uh, follow us on uh, Instagram as well. We follow her as well. Shout out to Weezy uh, Blonde. She got some uh, dope wrestling content as well, man. We met some cool uh, content creators from this whole CM Punk returning, man. It's It's been great. Oh, they did it. They fucking did it. <laughs> Oh my god, it's not. Oh. oh my god! Oh my god! Dude, it happened! Oh my god! <laughs> what? It actually happened! No! No way! No, <laughs> Shout way. Out to Super. no fucking way! Holy shit! What the fuck? Oh! Oh, shit. No fucking <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> my man spit the whatever he was drinking out. He had the Oh, this was great. Holy shit! Oh my god, it's CM Punk. Oh, we gotta run that back. My man spit whatever he was drinking out. It's all over the floor now. That was fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god, it's CM Punk, dude! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> oh, 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 That's so cool. Pinch it. <laughs> This is so good. Oh my fucking god! Whoa! <laughs> oh! 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 oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Oh my god! No way! What? They did! I have put my mic! <laughs> 
<laughs> Look at all these reactions, bro. What the fuck? He said, whoa, 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 whoa. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Is it CM Punk? Oh, my God. <laughs> This is so no way. Go to all it. No way. <laughs> yep, that's a thought. I'm glad to know that I wasn't the only one that went crazy. That's all. I, this this was this is the confirmation I needed, man. No! Now, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to check oh. out a similar video where we list 15 crazy endings to a wrestling show. This was fantastic, bro. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a like because this deserves a lot of likes. Um, I appreciate everyone. <laughs> that is, uh, let me know about this video. Uh, I had already seen it earlier this morning, like seeing that it was uh, in my sub box, but y'all definitely let me know <laughs> on social media to check this out. Y'all knew I was. This is fantastic. I enjoyed every second of this, seeing other people's reactions, especially live at the event. Sometimes, like, just that that rawness, that just, you can't explain it, the excitement. This is what it's like to be a wrestling fan. Some people may not understand it, and it's not meant for them to understand. We can just sit back, let the problems that we're dealing with of the world go away, and watch some wrestling and enjoy it and have a good time that's what wrestling is really all about every single person that went crazy that had a reaction that lost their shit in this video that's what it's about that's what it's about moments like this that we'll never forget i'll never forget cm punk returning back to wwe i'll never forget that moment i'll never forget when john cena made his return at money in the bank to face roman like some of these moments will live on in my head forever and those are good memories you know so comment down below let me know what was your favorite return ever of all time what was your favorite return just it's just anytime like you can instantly go back and watch that return and it always will give you goosebumps like your favorite one it doesn't have to be the recent cm punk it could be anyone of and it doesn't even have to be wwe it can be aw it can be wcw any wrestling company you want it to be what's your favorite return where a wrestler came back and it just made you personally lose your shit let me know down below but i appreciate all the love and support you guys have shown on the channel road to 150k and i'm still young speedy youtube wrestling champ of the world appreciate y'all kicking in with me see y'all on the next one peace